Virginia, you're considering a new procedure. And, Bird, tell me if this sounds a little odd. It's not a procedure. It's a product. Okay. I'm already annoyed. <laughs> it's a product. Huh? It's a product. I'm already product. annoyed. All right. Not a procedure. I've done many procedures, and I'm not above procedures. So it's a product you'll use on yourself? It's a product that I found out about, you know, through my circles of aging women, and we talk, and we... One area of the face I think a lot of us zone in on as a clear area where you can tell a woman's age is the eye. A lot of us struggle with our eyes and the aging around our eyes, Mm -hmm. especially if you're like me and you've had small eyes since birth. My dad has small eyes. I have his eyes. So my eyes have always been small. You made up with it with the mouth. (laughs) But now... (laughs) Yeah, how is it... One hole so small, the other so big. <laughs> Don't watch yourself. It's going to come for you. It all evens itself out. The mouth out. will come for you. <laughs> it's not your turn. The eyes, for me, have always been an area that has been tiny, and I wish that they were big. I wish I had big, beautiful eyes, but I don't. Yeah, but I don't know that you can really alter your but size of your eyes. Now that I'm aging, what happens is this lid gets heavy up here. My mom has got a heavy lid. I got a heavy lid now. And you got it, a heavy eyelid? Yeah, it's a thing. I know. You think I'm crazy, but I'm not the only one. I, honestly, I don't think the debate's not about thinking you're crazy. I think <laughs> it's now just trying to get you some help. <laughs> Find out so much. I didn't know Virginia had tiny eyes, and now she's got heavy eyelids. <laughs> she she doesn't have. I had no idea. She doesn't about have you. tiny eyes. Just like remember when she got her, her widow's peak lanced off? Didn't even know she had a widow's peak. She comes in, got my widow's peak lanced off, Kev. Like, uh, didn't even know you had one. Yeah, I was straight up Eddie Munster. Okay, go, go on. So. I found out about these eye drops called Upneak. And what they are is like an eye drop, like a visine. Yeah. You put it in your eye, and it just gives you a bigger eye. I've looked at the pictures online. I've looked at... How's it give you a bigger eye? It, I don't know, Kevin. It's a magic <laughs> drop. It opens up your eye, making them look larger, more white it's to treat a a low eyelid a small eye like it makes your eye bigger and i'm like oh should i try this i think it's always smart to put things in your body when you don't know what it's made of kevin (laughs) what's it made of i don't know kev i have no idea doesn't she get all over you about eating hot pockets it's amazing i mean hot pockets are gross you put them chemicals in her body you're so silly i I drink a mountain dew oh my gosh oh my gosh the things you put Uh, in your body soda is the devil but yeah i'm gonna put eye drops gonna make my eyes big (laughs) Yeah. Soda never made any more anybody more beautiful. I don't even understand how this is possible. I didn't either, and as a small eyed person I didn't even heard of the small eye concept. I, I, didn't, I, never, I never look at people and be like, Oh my gosh, look how small their eyes are. This I'm is a very, sep. This I'm is a, a sep. Small, small brain conversation. <laughs> Small eyed people always wish they had bigger eyes. You are insane. You don't have small eyes. Small I think eyes. you've got that body dysmorphia kind of a situation. And that's really what we should be concentrating on more than putting weird things in your body. It, it, it. Let me guess, these things are not cheap, right? I don't think they're that expensive. I think it was like, you know, uh, 50 bucks, maybe, let's say. 50 For a drop? For, no. <laughs> No, for a bottle. <laughs> well, it's not It's not lasting. If It's one of those things where you put it in your eye, it probably swells up your eye a little bit, and then in an hour and a half later, you look old again. Not you. I'm saying the universal, <laughs> the universal you. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how long it lasts. There are some side effects. What? Uh, what are the side effects? Blurred vision. Oh, my gosh. Dry eye. What? Eye redness. Fake pink eye. Oh, That's my goodness. One. Right. <laughs> so then, yeah, when I read those, I was like, oh, man, I don't want that stuff. But we got to go back to the, the, the thing about her having small eyes. And heavy eyelids. You don't have small. What are you talking what? about? I've always had tiny eyes. All right, Kevin, a count of three. <laughs> Virginia, you're beautiful. One, two, three. Virginia, you're, you're beautiful. beautiful. Yeah. And your no, eyes are normal. Uh, shiny. Shut up. Small. <laughs> Small. <laughs> this is like uh, getting the eye without the surgery. Because some people do like surgery where they cut the extra skin off the top of your eye. I mean, why not just cut your eyelid off? Do you really need them? 
And now you're just talking ridiculous. <laughs> Uh, you know, you know, you have that kind of thing. Don't read the comments. Oh, you know, I'm not reading the comments on this one. Today, it would be a day to follow your wow. advice. Wow. <laughs> okay. How about but that, huh? For my tiny eyed girls, yeah. Upneek. That's the name of it. Upneek. Why aren't you happy, though, with who you I are? I am happy. No, I'm, but you, you don't. S- I'm like uh, Lowe's, always improving. But I look at your eyes, can't even. Can't, I, what am I? Even, never would have thought that. Even, never would have thought Virginia was looking in the mirror, being, have tiny eyes. Oh, the time when she came about her widow's peak, I go, yeah. what? what? Oh yeah, widow's peak laser procedure, bird. Okay. There you go. <laughs> all right, lady, all you tiny-eyed ladies out there. <laughs> what? Here's your eye drop. All my seps, wow. small-eyed persons. Oh, man.